Fox Carolina first alert weather day update. Morning everyone. I'm first alert meteorologist Catherine Noel. We are seeing some light showers out there currently. Most of us waking up dry, but maybe a few sprinkles to light showers even northern half of the upstate. Mainly seeing the focus of this in Belton. Maybe a moderate shower there towards Princeton, where shoals some lighter rain coming down into Hartwell and Coldwater. But zooming back out, you can see where this is coming from. The remnants of post tropical cyclone Francine still off towards areas in the north, and we're seeing the outskirts of this bringing in extra moisture from the Gulf today. So this is why we do have a first alert weather day in place. I will say, you know, it's the low end. We're not tracking a chance of severe weather, just showers, potentially some thunderstorms, building in some heavy rain too, and affecting those outdoor plans today. Asheville towards Hendersonville, picking up shower chances, even in the upstate this morning. So before you head out, you do want that umbrella. Overcast skies today as well, pairing nicely for Friday the 13th. Spartanburg could see some showers coming on through by 10, 11 o'clock, building into Union County. And then really, you're going to see the focus of it into northern half of the upstate, but Hendersonville into Asheville, where we see the heavier rain, potentially a low and severe thunderstorm. I think we're going to stay clear of the severe, but strong, maybe if anything, just some gustier winds already seeing nice breezes, though, outside of this. I think we'll stay away from severe today, as mentioned, but maybe some heavier rain too. future track rain is going to show you those totals have been taken down about a tenth of an inch to half of an inch in areas like the mountains, upwards of 0.8 for Brevard, but I think we stay most of us below that inch mark. Football forecast looking drier than originally anticipated. If you were to ask earlier for the start of this week, it looked like we were going to get more rain during this time, but this is good news. I think just cloudy, potentially cloudy cover, overcast skies, low 70s. Therefore, maybe you do want that long sleeve. Maybe you want that umbrella just in case, but that's going to be just better safe than sorry. Breezy conditions do stick around the weekend, though. Those east-northeast winds, and then we start to clear out, too. It looks like moisture chances are just going down and down for us. Overcast skies on Saturday, but staying fairly mild, 76 degrees, just a degree warmer into Sunday with a little bit more cloud cover. Even showing lower moisture chances for next week, too, but this is something we're going to be closely watching due to a potential for some rain to come in off the coast, but it looks like lower and lower chances with highs warming back to the 80s by Wednesday into next week. Mountains on and off scattered showers and thunderstorm chances for you as well and staying in the 70s into next week with your coolest day tomorrow with a high of 68 degrees. Ashley. All right, Catherine.